At the tender age of 17, I found myself embarking on an unexpected journey through the bustling streets of our small town. Not as a carefree teenager, but as a diligent pizza delivery boy for a beloved local joint. It was a role I had assumed for months, yet each night brought its own set of surprises and challenges. My trusty companion on these nocturnal adventures, a weathered, yet reliable old Toyota, the perfect steed for navigating the maze of streets in search of hungry customers. And as fate would have it, it was on one of those memorable Friday or Saturday nights during the coveted closing shift that the saga unfolded. With the clock ticking towards midnight, the orders continued to flood in, each one a testament to our loyal patrons' insatiable appetite for our savory creations. But amidst the flurry of activity, one order stood out, a solitary pie destined for a woman named Karen, tucked away in a distant corner of our town. A mere glance at the address raised eyebrows, a departure from our usual local deliveries, this one promised a journey of at least 15 minutes, a veritable odyssey in our neck of the woods. Yet, fueled by the anticipation of a generous tip for our troubles, I embarked on the expedition without hesitation. As the familiar streets faded into unfamiliar territory, I couldn't shake the feeling of anticipation mingled with apprehension. The neighborhood grew increasingly unfamiliar, its streets cloaked in an eerie silence that belied the late hour. Arriving at the designated address, I was met not by Karen, but by the curious gaze of two women, their eyes alight with an unexpected interest in the humble pizza delivery boy before them. Flustered by their attention, I stumbled through the customary exchange, barely registering their invitation to join them for a glass of wine. In hindsight, Perhaps I should have seen the warning signs, the lingering glances, the suggestive remarks. But in the moment, all I could muster was a nervous chuckle and a feeble attempt to blend into the background. Yet, as the evening wore on, their intentions became increasingly clear, veering into territory I was ill-prepared to navigate. Their proposition to explore the depths of the basement sent shivers down my spine, a primal instinct warning me of the dangers lurking beneath the surface. Summoning every ounce of courage, I descended into the darkness, my senses on high alert for any sign of danger. And though my heart raced with each step, it was the sight of movement in the shadows that finally spurred me into action. With adrenaline coursing through my veins, I made a hasty retreat, my mind reeling with the implications of what could have been. It was a brush with danger that left an indelible mark on my psyche, a stark reminder of the unpredictability of the night. Returning to the safety of the pizzeria, I recounted the harrowing tale to my incredulous co-workers, each word a testament to the perils that lurked in the darkness. It was a night I wouldn't soon forget, a cautionary tale of trust misplaced and instincts honed in the crucible of adversity. In the twilight hours of another bustling evening, I found myself once again donning the mantle of the pizza delivery hero, weaving through the labyrinthine streets of our town in search of hungry souls, craving a slice of cheesy perfection. Little did I know that this particular night would unravel into a tale of unexpected twists and turns. As I embarked on my nightly pilgrimage, the familiar hum of my trusty vehicle served as a comforting backdrop to the chaos that lay ahead. With each order received, I embarked on a journey that was as much a test of my navigational prowess as it was a quest for culinary satisfaction. But amidst the routine of it all, fate had a different plan in store for me. It was a call for a delivery that would lead me down a path fraught with intrigue and danger a journey that would test the limits of my courage and resolve. The order seemed innocuous enough. A simple cheese pizza and a side of garlic knots, destined for a nondescript address on the outskirts of town. Yet as I traversed the winding roads that led me there, 
a sense of unease began to settle over me like a dark cloud. Arriving at the designated location, I was met not by the warm glow of a welcoming porch light, but by the eerie silence of an abandoned street. The house loomed before me like a silent sentinel, its windows shrouded in darkness that seemed to swallow the feeble glow of my headlights. Undeterred by the ominous atmosphere, I approached the door with cautious steps, my senses on high alert for any sign of danger. With a hesitant knock, I awaited a response, but the only reply was the hollow echo of my own heartbeat in the stillness of the night. As I stood there grappling with uncertainty, a sudden movement caught my eye. A shadow flitting across the window, gone in an instant, yet leaving an indelible impression on my psyche. It was then that I knew I was not alone. Summoning every ounce of courage, I pressed on, determined to fulfill my duty despite the creeping sense of dread that threatened to overwhelm me. With trembling hands, I reached for the doorbell, only to be met with silence once more. But just as I was about to turn away, a voice pierced the darkness, sending a chill down my spine. It was a woman's voice, tinged with desperation and fear, pleading for help from behind the locked door. In that moment, instinct took over, propelling me into action as I raked it against time to summon aid for the mysterious stranger trapped within. With each passing second, the weight of responsibility hung heavy on my shoulders, driving me forward despite the looming specter of danger. And as I waited for the distant wail of sirens to herald the arrival of salvation, I couldn't help but marvel at the strange twists of fate that had led me to this moment. For in the darkness of that fateful night, I had been given a glimpse into the depths of human resilience and the power of compassion to overcome even the darkest of shadows. As the sun dipped below the horizon, casting long shadows over the sleepy town. I embarked on another evening shift as the humble purveyor of piping hot pizzas. With each delivery, I traversed the familiar streets, weaving through the fabric of our community, delivering not just food, but a taste of comfort and connection in a world fraught with uncertainty. But on this particular night, fate had a different plan in store for me. It began like any other shift, with orders streaming in, and my trusty vehicle carrying me from doorstep to doorstep with practiced ease. Little did I know that one seemingly routine delivery would soon spiral into a whirlwind of adventure and intrigue. The order came in for a deluxe supreme pizza with all the fixings, destined for an address nestled in the heart of the town's historic district. As I made my way through the cobblestone streets, I couldn't shake the feeling of anticipation tinged with a hint of apprehension. Arriving at the designated address, I was greeted not by the warm glow of porch lights, but by the eerie silence of an empty street. The house stood before me like a silent sentinel, its windows shrouded in darkness that seemed to whisper of hidden secrets. Undeterred by the foreboding atmosphere, I approached the door with cautious steps, my senses on high alert for any sign of danger. With a hesitant knock, I awaited a response, but the only sound was the gentle rustle of leaves in the evening breeze. Just as I was about to turn away, a faint voice called out from within, its tone tinged with urgency and fear. Instinct took over as I pushed open the door, revealing a scene straight out of a mystery novel. Before me stood a woman, her face etched with lines of worry as she recounted a tale of intrigue and deception. It seemed she had stumbled upon a conspiracy brewing in the shadows of our seemingly idyllic town. And now, she looked to me for aid in unraveling the truth. With adrenaline coursing through my veins, I pledged to help her, setting off on a quest to uncover the secrets hidden within our community's darkest corners. Together, we delved into a world of clandestine meetings, cryptic messages, and unexpected allies each step bringing us closer to the heart of the mystery. And as the night wore on, I couldn't help but marvel at the serendipitous chain of events that had led me to this moment. For in the midst of delivering pizzas, 
I had stumbled upon an adventure worthy of a tale spun under the glow of a midnight moon.